Hello everybody, Mobius1 here bringing you the episode 2 or 3 I guess if you count the uh, opening cutscene of Ori in the Blind Forest. Um, let's take a look at our map. Our objective currently find the Ginso tree, which if I remember correctly, yep, way up here. Um, just want to let you guys know I am at Takora's house and people are sleeping, so I'm going to kind of be whispering, but uh... Let's see if we can't have fun with this anyway. Alright, so... We're gonna have to work our way back down this way, it looks like. And then go back past the room that we started in to the right. So let us explore a little bit, shall we? Oh look! A new tree! Anno, the spirit that died here, was strong and courageous. Listen to his voice, he was able to focus our light. You have learned Charge Flame! To use this ability, hold left mouse to charge, then release left mouse to detonate and damage everything in proximity. Well, guess what we can do with that? Actually, let's see. Let's see if there's anything we can <laughs> secret area wise or anything. Doesn't look like it. Uh, press and hold left mouse to charge flame. Boom, baby. Broke through that wall. Let's go back up to our save point. Because now. Oh, wait. This thing. We can actually break these guys open with Charge Flame and get a whole bunch of XP. Oops. We almost have enough for another skill point. This is the way, yeah, okay. We have to go this way. Oh, look! A large spirit-like container. Alright, let's take a look. We have one skill point to spend. What do we want? Increases the strength of spirit flame. That's pretty handy. Makes most pickups show up on the map. Or creating a soul link restores one life. Hmm... Um, I really want to get Ultra Spirit Magnet so that most pickups are automatically absorbed. And this one right here doubles the amount of life that we get from life pickups, so I'm going to go ahead and do this. We'll work our way up the uh, middle branch to at least this, and then we'll start getting some of the other ones. We didn't really need that, but whatever. Okay, so now this is back where we started. So now we're gonna go to the right. Oh, we really can't, unless we want to get hurt. No, we can't go that way. Oh, we, were we supposed to go up that way? Oh, we were, weren't we? Whoops. Well, at least you guys won't have to watch all this in regular speed. Okay, so now we're back up here. We're in the hollow grove. Look at that thing. That's a big thing. Let's 
So these guys, when you kill them, they actually pop and break into smaller things. I don't know if we can actually get... No. We can't get around here just yet. I think we need... We need at least double jump to get around this piece of bark. So we'll have to come back for that. a big spider thing and it's being held supported by that rocket that's on the ceiling an energy door so this is basically just like a shortcut I think and it requires four energy but we only have one so we can't go in there just yet unfortunately we have to climb on the spider sack Man. Let's see what's over here first. Oh, good. Crystal. So, we're gonna save our game. This should give us full energy. Yeah, okay. Let's go through this first. Ooh, that hurt. Ooh, I'd like to sell. That's good. Give us more health. I hope I can make it. Ow! Okay, that hurt. And now, this actually took me a little bit to figure out, but you're supposed to uh, use charge flame to break this rock up top. And that causes that to drop. You can then land on it. Ooh. And then there's gonna be there's some power up over to the left, but we can't get over there just yet, so we're gonna go to the right. Good, this will let us save. We got another ability point. Let us spend that one. So now life pickups will restore twice as much life. Very good. Very handy indeed. Oh, there's a wall here. We'll have to figure out how to open that. These little blue things are like bounce pads. You may have seen me use them in the last episode, but I don't think I really explained what they do. They just let you bounce. Higher. Oh, another a map thing. I don't think we don't have a map stone, do we? No. I want to find one. Oh, there it is, over there. Whoops. Oh, there's an ability cell up there. I would love to get that, but unfortunately we're gonna have to wait. Oh, this place. I remember the very first time I played this. This is the 
route that I started to come, and this is not the way you're supposed to go. These enemies are way too hard for you at this level. Look at how much health this guy has, and he leaves little lava bubbles on the ground wherever he shoots. The good thing about it, though, is they drop a lot of XP. scary some of the stuff up here is. Look at this guy. Oh god! And last but not least... Freaking laser guy! So we're not going to be going the rest of that way. Oh god, I'm dead. <laughs> Let's get a little bit more XP before we leave. Oh look, he just broke this open for us. Hey, is this a life cell? Oh yeah! Cool. Alright, well that was worth doing. So at least now we have more health. So this is where we should get the map stone. Yep. Okay. Is this a secret area? No. How do we get in there? I want to get in there. I could really use that energy cell. Hmm. Oh, and there's a life cell right there, too. How do we get in there? Oh, they must be from up here. Uh, oh well. Ouch. Or he makes such a sad sound when he takes damage. Plug that map stone in, baby. Yep, see. Exactly. So there's oh wow, there's a lot up here. But uh yeah, you can see those that energy cells right here and that life cell is right here, so this is probably connected in there somewhere. Oh, but we still have to move on to the right. So we're on through the Thornfelt Swamp. What is this thing in the foreground? So with this boulder, we actually have to push it to this side so that we can jump on the other side of it and push it back, but while we're here we might as well save. Make sure there are no secret areas. No, it doesn't look like it. brought light and hope to the forest. Others gave in, embraced darkness and fear. Look, there's the guy, and he's got a thing. 
a Guman from the Forlorn Ruins. We must follow his steps. We must get what he stole. Oh man, new objective. Regain the water vein. Without the water vein, the Ginso tree is closed shut. Alright, so we, we found the Ginso tree, but now we have to find the water vein. Which the map is actually not even showing me where that is, but we, he went this way, so we might as well go this way. Oh, we're so close to getting an ability point. Gumon, wait! Ultra Spirit Magnet. Now we will automatically pick up, uh, absorb all pickups, regardless of where they are. I don't know if I can make that jump. Ugh. Oh, this part. Okay, we're gonna see these guys a lot, so it's important to learn what they do. They are these weird tentacle guys that shoot these projectiles at you, and you have to be careful because they leave, like, spiky bits on the ground. But you'll notice, wherever they shoot is actually strong enough to bust open walls and, and break things. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Now the reason that's important is because of this part coming up, I think right here. Yeah. We're actually gonna have to use them to our benefit. So he breaks that. And then that lets this guy come to life. Oh no, this guy has to break this tree. And that releases this guy, who breaks that rock. And then this guy, who breaks that tree. Oh god. And then this guy, who breaks the door. Ta-da. Save our game, shall we? The Moon Grotto. Man, he's, he's an agile little thing, isn't he? Oh! Ouch. Okay, that scared me. Yes, we saw him do this. Let's not get hit with that laser. Sorry, I'm hearing noises. Oh, yeah, and someone sneaking up behind me. Okay. Be very careful here. Go, 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 go. Jump! Oh, that was close. Okay, save again. Can I make it up there? No, not yet. We can't go that way yet, there's too many spikes, so we'll go down here. Definitely can't go that way yet. Oh good, a spirit well. Where's it going? I don't know if I can go this way yet. Is 
a guy here. See, this just loops back around. This looks like a secret area, though. Nice. Okay. So nice, now I have three. That was worth it. door. This one only requires two energy, which we have, but where does that go? Oh, it goes somewhere new. We might as well open it. Oh, shoot. I can't. Oh, great. There's no way I can make all that. I need to go, I need to go this way first, I think. I'm pretty sure. Oh god! Well, that was just great. Now we're in Gumo's hideout. Oh god, I have no energy to save and this is a boss fight. Let's uh, save the game, shall we? 
Oh god! Alright. Phew, one point. Let's do, uh... Let's increase the strength of Spirit Flame. That way we kill these guys a little bit quicker. Because these enemies are starting to get more health now. There's the last fragment that we need. Oh, but there's spikes on the thing. Hey -ya! That was close. Oh, that hurt. Ouch, that hurt too. Ooh, spikes everywhere. Oh, another tree. We're learning all kinds of skills today. An ancestral tree, Leiru, lay here. She was swift, agile, used to cut through the air. You've learned double jump. Press space to leap into the air, then press space again to jump even higher. Oh yeah. Double jump is awesome. You know what's better than double jump? Triple jump. Gumo. Gumon. Whatever your name is. What are you doing? supposed to go? No, we're supposed to go back. There's gotta be something over here. Whoa, that's a big bitch! Oh, an energy cell. Yes! Thank you. Totally worth it. Is there a secret area down there? There looks like there would be. No? No? I guess not. What about on the other side? No? Surprising. I had to put one in there. Ah! Oh, 
of the map. Holy moly, there's a lot more down here. We might actually have to wrap this episode up here. So, uh... We'll, uh, we'll finish doing the Moon Grotto in the next episode, and we'll probably make our way back up to the Ginso Tree. But for now, I'm going to cut this here because it's been a half hour. So, thank you guys for watching. I hope you're enjoying this series. This game is still one of my favorite games. And I hope it becomes one of yours too. Maybe it's one here. See you guys next time.